Good afternoon and welcome to the uh, Trinity College uh, Rugby Stadium here in Palle Kelly. Today, a crucial encounter of the fourth week in the Dialogue Schools Rugby League 2023 is taking place here as uh, the home team, Kingswood, will take on St. Joseph's who have travelled here all the way from Colombo. An important clash for both the teams. St. Joseph's, they have won just one game in this season so far. That also was a very close game against Wesley College and Kingswood. They're still searching for that first win of the tournament. So this game is a very important for both the teams to make sure that they uh, get their campaigns back on track here in the fourth week of the Dialogue Schools Rugby League 2023. few moments away. Yesterday, you're at the same venue, uh, St. Peter's, they managed to uh, keep their unbeaten record alive against the uh, home team, Trinity College, in a game um, which ended as 22 points to 10 in favour of the Peterites, who have won all their three games at the moment. So, uh, joining with me on commentary for the game is uh, Muad Razik. Muad, week three fixtures, uh, week three results here, we had some very close games. Of course, uh, you're a good, good old school, Easy Patana College. Uh, uh, took on uh, St. Joseph's College uh, last week, Longdon Place, a cracker of a game, uh, a clash uh, between Titans, uh, expected as much, uh, St. Joseph's gave a good fight, 18 points to 28 in favour of Isipathana going home with that big bonus point, now they have all bonus points uh, in their hand, and of course uh, St. Thomas has uh, got the better of Kingswood uh, at Mount Lavinia, got the bonus point 28-17, it was the closest encounter that Kingswood had, a fair outing for them after a uh, uh, Annihilation from uh, Isipatana in the first week uh, at Bogambara Royal, trouncing over with Yartha 47 points to 3 as they did yesterday against Zaira. And Zaira, the week before, uh, took on a 24 8 uh, win against uh, Science. They went down They went down to uh, Royal yesterday uh, with a thumping 42 uh, points to 3 uh, victory, uh, loss. And with Dharmaraj going down against St. Peter's the previous week uh, and also yesterday, it was a 29 points, a 22 close encounter for Dharmaraj. What could have been the first draw of encounter, drawn encounter of the season? And nonetheless, Vidyata took the better of Dharmaraj. And of course, uh, Wesley went down to DS and Anayaka, the dark horses of uh, this year's tournament. And DS went down to Isipatana on Friday at Havelock Park, uh, 22 points to 6. Uh, so we have... Uh, Another interesting encounter this year, uh, last, uh, last season, uh, St. Joseph's uh, gave a hiding to Kingswood at uh, Havelock Park. Kingswood were just uh, outclassed in their opening encounter. As Kingswood had a very hard time last year, Muad. Uh, they lost all their games and uh, they, I think, uh, scored their first try in the fourth or the fifth game of the season. So, uh, as Muad mentions, uh, mentioned here, the uh, results from the previous four games of the week, Isipatana keeping the unbeaten record intact. Uh, St. Peter's also joining with Isipatana as the unbeaten team of the tournament. Royal absolutely uh, destroying Saira College, who also an unbeaten team, and with the Arthur uh, getting a much needed win against uh, Dharmaraja. Dharmaraja started uh, very well uh, by beating Trinity for the first time ever, but uh, since then they have struggled. And uh, the points table of Group 1A, Isipatana, four games, four wins and most importantly, four bonus points, 24 points for them. St. Thomas is in second place, 11 points. DSN and Iger in third place uh, with 11 points. St. Anthony's, six. St. Joseph still with five points. This is why this game is very important for them and Wesley, just two points. And Kingswood yet to register a single point in this tournament. And uh, Group 2A. Royal at the top, um, they have played one more game than St. Peter's. They have 19 points and they have four bonus points. That's the plus for them. Uh, Peter tries three games, three wins, uh, 16 bonus points, but just one uh, bonus point. They have a total of 16 points. Uh, Saira, three games, two wins. Uh, they have one bonus point, so the total is 11. With the other, after four games, they are on 11. They have a bonus point as well. Dharmaraja, they lost some close games, so they have three bonus points and they have one win, so their total is eight. Trinity at the 6th place at the moment in Group 2A with just 6 points and uh, Science College after 3 games they lost all their games and they have just 1 point, a uh, 1 losing point uh, which they got, losing bonus point which they got uh, from the 3 games so uh, 
it's uh, getting uh, very heated up there we all know only the top two teams will advance through to the next round of this tournament and uh, at the moment if it continues to be in the same way uh, it's going to be uh, Isipatana and uh, St. Thomas's ODS from the other group and Royal and St. Peter's uh, from Group 2A. So uh, we have some important games coming up in the next few weeks, uh, Muad, uh, especially three uh, very uh, special games from the other group. Uh, we have St. Thomas's taking on DS, St. Thomas's taking on St. Joseph's and St. Joseph's against DS. So those three games will most probably decide which team will advance through the next round along with the Green Machine. Yes, uh, the high-riding DS uh, lads gave uh, a match of a lifetime for Isipatana to remember. They put uh, Isipatana under pressure and of course uh, down in Colombo Royal Complex, Wesley is taking on St. Anthony's. Wesley looking for that uh, maiden victory in this year's school season whereas uh, St. Anthony's uh, are back after a week's rest uh, after playing uh, DS uh, in their opening encounter and they played uh, another encounter they played against uh, St. Joseph's, Joseph's in the opening encounter yes. and won the game and then uh, lost to DS in Anayaga. So it will be an interesting clash in Colombo as well. Uh, Wesley, after a good high riding season last year, uh, having a bit of a trouble this year, having very inch closed uh, encounters but failing to get that big W. So uh, you are just a few moments away from the kickoff, so we will be back, but before that, Aloe vera and mint for freshness, chamomile for sensitive skin, lemon and lime for an energetic day. Big shaving foam, a change you must experience. Hey, have you heard about Z? Z Z. We KYC. Easy. Mobile banking. Crazy. Education loans and salary advances. Amazing. Introducing the digital youth account. NDBZ. NDBZ from NDB Bank. The future is banking on us. Oh, go look the new event together. Dress code is black. Black? No problem. Now we're ready to look at Dandex. Active Climbersol Palamusay Adi Menma is sorry Ivan Karai. Subhavika Saryan he's a portion of Karai. Not a mother. No problem. Hamad Hamu Dandex now. Hamad Hamu no problem. Dandex he's a Nida Hase Idiriyata. Kaloma beautiful outside.
Education loans and salary advances. Amazing. Amazing. Introducing the digital youth account. NDBZ. NDBZ from NDB Bank. The future is banking on us. Yeah. Your embrace so warm with one more bite of revel for sunshine. Enjoy the infinite possibilities of the freedom of space, inspired by the beauty of our land. Sri Lanka's finest finished, largest sized porcelain tile collection. Majestica. Langa tiles. Fine living. Redefined. Welcome back to the uh, live action from the uh, Palakale Rugby Stadium. St. Joseph's taking on uh, Kingswood, uh, as we mentioned earlier, before the uh, break. As uh, St. Joseph's, uh, Kingswood, uh, both the teams are yet to uh, get their tournament going um, the way that they really want to. Both the teams are languishing in the bottom half of their group at the moment. So they really need to um, get this uh, W from the game to make sure that they uh, have a strong end and have a shot at uh, qualifying for the next round. The uh, St. Joseph's team card, uh, Jehan Atukora, Chamot Kavin, De Indura Sandish, Aishan, Lanka, Janit Marasing, Ashen, Mindra, Sachin, Vaidinata, Navin Marasing, the skipper, Vihanga Prandeep, Bishma Jayasekar, Shanuka, Alahakon, Ivano White, Ruchita Rodrigo, Senuta Iran, and Randika Dananjaya. Kingswood College, uh, the home side, Tharan Dushara, Dulish Rasanjana, Devmin Hevake, Akhila Dilshan, Rehan Silva, Dumidu Di Silva, Shashit Amkotu, Pramod Fernando, Tavishya Ganayaka, Aftab Asmi, Anudha Sikurajutpati, Dinal Bandar, Iman Kishara, the skipper, Oshudavira Sekara and Rivin Baudin. It's interesting to see in that uh, team lineup, um, Muad, Ishan Inun, the number 8 is missing, uh, had a good uh, first game against Isivatna. So uh, they have decided to go for another option. Um, had a good uh, seventh tournament as well, Ishan Inun. I think actually he's the vice captain of the team as well. So a key player. Uh, let's see why he has been benched. Uh, we have not been notified yet. But uh, uh, seems like uh, a tactical change. We might also opt. Uh, let's see how, how it goes. And he is benched, so he's not out of the game. Uh, very vital player for Kingswood. The match officials, Pranit Veranga, uh, Ravin Alexander, Kalum Sandurwan, an experienced uh, set of... Uh, as uh, Ruchita Rodrigo for St. Joseph's uh, with the kickoff. A good uh, kick uh, deep into the Kingswood uh, territory. Goes for the uh, clearance kick here and that goes into touch. Will be the first line out of the game uh, for St. Joseph's. Taken eye cut this drama for Kingswood uh, making that uh, collection of the kickoff. Some on the Senvi Ratna, the hooker for uh, the Joes with the uh, throw in for the line out. The first line out of the game, Senvi Ratna to throw. Very well taken, very good collection uh, from uh, Ayesha and Lanka. 
St. Joseph's going for the uh, rolling mall early in the game. Kingswood uh, trying their level best to uh, keep a hold of this. They're still going. King St. Joseph's Kingswood yet to find an answer. They're nearing that uh, 22 meter line. St. Joseph's. The ball almost got loose, but uh, here's the big man, the big forward uh, for St. Joseph's making a move for the try line. St. Joseph's. Very well done. Very good defensive work from uh, Kingswood. Here's Navin Marasinga, the big man, the skipper for Joes. Gets taken down. The younger Andeepa tried to uh, take the ball out. And uh, Kingswood. Uh, St. Joseph's uh, on the attack in the 22 meter territory of uh, Kingswood. Here's Navin Marasinga. Takes the ball from Randi but tries to advance towards the try line but uh, gets taken down immediately. Last is here under the post penalty. Randi opted for the quick tap. So let's see how it goes. And that is a cheeky move by the number 21, I guess uh, it was, for St. Joseph's College. Kingswood uh, trying their level best here. Just few meters away, St. Joseph's College from scoring that uh, first try of the game. Is that the first try? Yes, it is. Brilliant work from the Joes. Skipper Navin Marasinga getting over for the first try of the game. Great piece of work from the skipper. The big number eight, uh, arguably one of the biggest lads here. In this year's Alex Tools Rugby League, Navin Marasinga leading from the front, uh, not going uh, for the under the post penalty, which uh, was a sitter. They opted for the quick tap and they are showing clear intentions that they are here for that bonus point, uh, four try bonus point uh, tries. So this is uh, Skipper Marasinga almost uh, went on, looked on as if uh, it was held up, but uh, he scores right on the money and uh, Ruchita Rodrigo. who had a decent record uh, in this season, especially putting over that sultry penalty against Wesley, almost 50 meters. So he is capable of uh, his kicking abilities. Here's Rodrigo to add the uh, two extra points. It doesn't go, so it will stay five points to nil. St. Joseph's, uh, they have taken the early lead in this game in the third minute. Skipper Navin Maru Singh. Uh, Going over for the first try of the game. And Rusta Rodrigo, unfortunately, couldn't uh, get the conversion over. Apologies on my behalf for all the Joe's supporters. It could have been a commentator's curse uh, where I was uh, complimenting Rodrigo's uh, kicking abilities. Referee Veranga stops the game. Citing some issue with the grass of the pitch. Is the referee not happy with the uh, condition out there? Talk about ground conditions, Lux is here. Bogambra Stadium uh, during this season. Uh, seems to have uh, a bit of a uh, you know, hectic affair, whereas uh, Pallakale ground uh, looks pretty neat and green uh, when compared to Bogambra, which had been hosting lots and lots of games, not only in the top division, but in the lower divisions as well. So. Uh, Bit of a confusing situation here at the Pali Kale turf. Look what I can If you're just uh, joining with us, um, this is St. Joseph's College taking on Kingswood. You're at the uh, Trinity College Rugby Stadium in Pali Kale. This is a week four encounter of the Dialogue Schools Rugby League 2023. And uh, you can catch all the live action from the Dialogue Schools Rugby League uh, on www.thepapare.com, the uh, papare.com uh, Facebook page and the papare.com uh, YouTube page as well. So uh, the pause uh, is still happening at the moment, uh, an ongoing pause because of that uh, because of that uh, ground condition which uh, the referee is not happy with and uh, this is the uh, gold uh, cool blaster 3 in 1 hair body and uh, face wash 
something that uh, you must have in your arsenal. Make sure to uh, buy that from uh, any leading uh, supermarket or pharmacy in Sri Lanka. News from uh, Royal Complex is uh, Wesley is uh, leading seven points to nil. A bit of a shocker for many of the fans uh, because Wesley has always been lagging in the uh, scoring part. Uh, in fact, uh, they scored uh, more than two tries, uh, mo more than a try last week uh, against DS. Uh, whereas here in Palakira, it's a bit of a stoppage uh, here. St. Joseph's uh, showing early, early intentions. And also, uh, we need to remind you about uh, Karuna.lk, the first uh, course verified uh, crowdfunding platform in Sri Lanka. It is uh, making a significant difference in the lives of uh, people in need. This uh, timely and relevant platform serves as a bridge between generous donors and deserving individuals aiming to empower and enrich Sri Lankan lives through social stewardship. So make sure to uh, visit Karuna.lk and... Uh, do your research on the uh, project as well. So uh, here we are. We are back uh, with the uh, live action from the St. Counter. St. Joseph's uh, straight after that try. They have uh, knocked it forward. It's uh, Sachin Tanavai Danata who made that terror from the restart kick. Uh, dropped the ball forward uh, straight towards the uh, Kingswood player. The referee will uh, go back to that uh, point of the knock forward. Kingswood College uh, getting that chance to uh, bite back straight away. Uh, just like the uh, kills and nightmares uh, sausages, they bite that bites back. Kingswood, now they have the chance to bite back. St. Joseph scored that first try. And now it's Kingswood's opportunity to uh, go into that 22-meter territory of uh, St. Joseph's and uh, try to uh, level this course. Last year, uh, again, again uh, St. Joseph's did that uh, cardinal error of relaxing soon after scoring. So that is costing. And as we see, Vaidhanatha, who was rested at the Wesley game, uh, is now uh, play having a blood uh, bin. So the referee stops time uh, for a blood replacement. Uh, that is uh, number 28 uh, replacing uh, Vaidhanatha, Inosh Silva. Ekanayaka, the Kings would uh, strum up uh, with the feed into the scrum. The referee not happy uh, with uh, what uh, happened at the scrum, so he will ask to uh, re engage. There's Ekanayaka with the feed in. Steady, both steady. Zeke Naika gets tackled. Uh, that's clearly an advantage uh, for the home team, Kingswood. Let's see what they will opt for, and they go for the posts. Crucial kick coming up. Uh, down by uh, five points, uh, Kingswood. So, if this goes through, this is uh, Azmi for Kingswood uh, trying to add the three points uh, from that penalty. Red behind the ball, Red. And. Uh, down in Colombo, Wesley College uh, with the early lead against uh, the Eagles, uh, seven points to nil at the Royal Complex. And it doesn't go over. Asmi misses the penalty, so it will stay five points to nil. Not what uh, the Kingswood uh, team wanted uh, from that uh, wait, kick wait, wait, wait. by Asmi. Number seven. That was close, but unfortunately, I uh, didn't have the uh, direction wait, 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 wait. from Azmi. So here's uh, Ruchita Rodrigo with the uh, 22 meter dropout. As Kingswood uh, makes the collection. And here they are. 
Yes, Kingswood on the move here. That was uh, Badudin. But unfortunately, they have uh, given the ball back to uh, Joes. Looked like a promising move from Badudin. Uh, tried to uh, run straight towards that uh, defense and find that uh, gap. But unfortunately, he has given the ball away. Points in gain for in vain for Kings Wood Luxury. I think the penalty they took that was the first time they came in, came inside the red zone of uh, St Joseph's, uh, but missing that kick uh, at Sorandipa with a beautiful uh, clearance uh, to find touch and uh, go in for that. Uh, probably they might go in again for the rolling mall, which they are quite strong in and they're quite confident with their heavy set of uh, forwards. As they're close to that 22 meter line, uh, in around the same area they uh, went for the rolling mall earlier and uh, that actually produced uh, that first try for them and that's a good uh, line out again, uh, Senemiratna with a very good throw and a good collection from uh, Lanka. And here's uh, Vihangarandeep, the uh, scrum half uh, also uh, coming in here, they are trying to advance with the rolling mall, Kingswood. Uh, they have done well so far, but uh, St. Joseph's still going forward with the rolling mall. They are still going, still going. And that's advantage. Kingswood, they have uh, won the ball back. As we finally like, see, see some uh, cheering going on here at the Palikali Stadium. This is not a packed house uh, compared to many other games, uh, especially we might have seen a bigger crowd if the match was played in Bogambara. But nonetheless, uh, there is uh, supporters from either sides uh, rooting for their teams. Azmi uh, didn't get the direction that he uh, wanted. But uh, nevertheless, they have the ball. They must make sure that uh, this line out is good. Rasanjana will be the one to uh, throw in. And they have uh, lost it, Kingswood. They have lost the ball forward, so advantage to St. Joseph's. Kingswood's defending their hearts out and playing to the referee calls on for an early advantage and knocked forward. Yes, it's going to be a scrum, scrum uh, for the uh, Joes. Uh, Kingswood, uh, they must uh, try to. Uh, prevent St. Joseph's from advancing into that 22-meter uh, territory again because uh, whenever they enter that area St. Joseph's uh, they look uh, very very dangerous and threatening especially with the fact that uh, they have someone like uh, Navin Marasinghe in their ranks uh, makes it even more dangerous so uh, Kingswood they must try to contain Joseph uh, before they arrive in that 22-meter territory a good scrum uh, for uh, St. Joseph's Vyanga Randeep gives the ball out, almost uh, fumbled it was uh, Jai Sekar. Yes, Randeep once again. Yes, Navin Marasinghe joining the line. Yes, Randeep. This is good. They have space. Yes, uh, Jai Sekar. Went straight towards that uh, defender of Kingswood. The ball is still available. Yes, uh, Randeep gives the ball out to Senevi Ratna. Senevi Ratna gained some valuable meters uh, for his team. Yes, Randeep. Now he backs out as the big forward uh, Atu Koral with the support of his skipper. Navin Marasinghe, is that the try? As you saw, the Josephian skipper is everywhere, supporting uh, the players to shove forward. And that's going to be... The second try, brilliant piece of work from uh, Jehan Natukoral and uh, well supported from the skipper Navin Mar Singha. Brilliant piece of work from St. Joseph's to uh, score that second try inside the first 15 minutes. Basically, Mar Singha helped uh, Natukoral to bulldoze over the try line. So, uh, 
Navin Mahar Singh are playing in his uh, usual habitat of number eight, paying dividends for Jose Suarez in the Wesley and the Antonian encounter. He was uh, switched between, uh, you know, playing centre, so he was utilised for that. But now uh, playing in his uh, back in number eight uh, seems to be pro providing results for the Josephians. Ruchita Rodrigo preparing for that uh, important co conversion. He missed the last one. And Rodrigo at the uh, two extra points here. Will that go through? No, fortunately it doesn't, so it will say 10 points to nil. Almost looked as if a positive uh, kick uh, from our angle, but uh, Rodrigo had the legs, but uh, not the direction, so remains 10-0 uh, uh, Laksi. So this uh, kicks uh, proved very vital. You remember yesterday's and also yesterday's Dharmaraj with Vidyartha game. The kicks eventually won the matches as you see a brilliant uh, uh, restart by Kingswood and earning that penalty. So they have been pretty good in these restarts, uh, getting the ball back. I was telling her, uh, kicks do win matches yesterday. Uh, Vidyarth College kicked five penalties, whereas their opponents, Rajan, scored four tries and got the bonus point but yet uh, lost the game. Yes, and also they added the uh, conversion points as well in both the tries of Vidyarth. That's why they managed to... Uh, Work out with the win. There's a hundred percent kicking rate for the Vidyarth uh, place kicker, so these kicks do matter when it comes to the final latter stages of the game. White and white. There's a Rasanjan for uh, Kingswood uh, with the uh, throw in. Kingswood, uh, they must try to uh, make this move work. Uh, try and score that uh, first uh, five point of the game for them. They trail by ten points. Ezra Sanjan gives the throw in, and that's a crooked throw. So they have uh, given the ball back to uh, St. Joseph's. I mean, this is the second time I think that they. Uh, came into the 22 meter territory of St. Joseph's but both the times before they make any attacking move they gave the ball away that has been the problem for Kingswood and here's a chance for St. Joseph's to uh, get out of jail once again Cardinal errors by a, these are minor errors which cost you very bad in the later stages of the game like they are coming in they are putting some brilliant pressure soon with the kickoff uh, where Joseph's are seeming to be having a relaxed time soon after the kickoff but Yet uh, that giving away possession uh, keeps uh, biting back the Kingswood lads, which has been happening throughout the season for them. They've been pretty unlucky last year as well. This year was much, much expected uh, from the lads from the La Randall Hills. So run deeper. The Josephians uh, ready for the put-in. Let's run deeper. And yes, uh, Naveen Marasinghe fends off the first defender, fends off the second one as well, gives the offload out to run deeper. There's Marasinghe again, he's everywhere today, acting as his scrum half there. Marasinghe out there again, but run deeper joins in this time. time off. The referee auto, auto having a little. Uh, chat uh, with his assistant I think no he's actually checking on uh, that uh, Kingswood player he's uh, down at the moment the medical officials are uh, checking on him probably uh, took a big hit to his shoulder the Silva seems to be a very tough guy. Got up soon after the hit, uh, but uh, these days uh, medical procedures uh, seem to be looked after. There's uh, many rugby players here at home and abroad internationally as well who've been suffering from different uh, head-related injuries later in life. Uh, so he's back. Yes, uh, that is uh, the Silva for uh, Kingswood. 
Det ska skriva. Det här är det. Nej, jag tror att The referee uh, just making sure that it was uh, just only the shoulder. <laughs> he didn't uh, hit the head. Scum. So uh, we will uh, go back to that uh, advantage uh, position for uh, St. Joseph's. It's going to be a scrum for them. If you see last like, year, the Josephian forwards looks very, very Push. hefty. Th heftier than their opponents. Uh, but uh, Kingswood also equally matching up to their task. But uh, definitely the lads from Maradana have the upper hand in terms of uh, the forwards and the back weight. The referee uh, not happy uh, with the scrum from both the teams. Coach! Giving a last warning to uh, both the teams uh, in that, uh, in that uh, moment is uh, Randeep with the feed in. As Navin Marsing again gives the ball out to young Randeep. Randeep tries to cut back inside. Nippy Randeep was uh, totally uh, annihilated by the Kingswood lads. Bit of a different tactic used there. The big man not going in for contact. They have a, an advantage, uh, the Josephians. A brilliant uh, kick to the hands, the bounce of the rugby ball. Ruch uh, Rodrigo. My word, what can you ask for? What more can you ask for with that bounce of the rugby ball? Gifting to the hands of uh, Rodrigo. Who's the Rodrigo score in that third try? It's a try fest here at the uh, Palikale Stadium already. We are inside the first uh, 16 minutes and uh, St. Joseph's, they have scored uh, three tries. So can they add the uh, two points at uh, this time? That little uh, cross kick uh, from St. Joseph's and then made the uh, clean collection there. I have to uh, make that correction. It's uh, the Hamjaya who uh, scored that try uh, for uh, St. Joseph's, the third try. Was, uh, and that's a successful conversion from uh, Randeep. In fact, it was uh, Randeep, I think, uh, who made that uh, little cross kick and then uh, the Hamjaya made the collection uh, with the chase and managed to uh, get over the try line so it's uh, 17 points to nil St. Joseph's College uh, they have uh, scored 17 points in as many minutes uh, here at Palle Calle the first uh, successful uh, kick for the Rodrigo Kingswood uh, defense just bamboozled uh, and uh, was thinking what was happening they couldn't believe uh, that bounce was picture perfect uh, to the hands of uh, the Hamja. Joes with a good collection. Kingswood not uh, lucky. Stay. Like the last time they got uh, their hands on to the ball soon after the stop, kickoff stop, and uh, run deeper. Stop. Rodrigo with the clearance uh, and fine in the hands of uh, the number eight. That is uh, Sikuru Ajupati, the wing three quarter for the boys from go Brandon run, go, Hills. Go, go, go. Going in for that cross uh, dancey move uh, across the park. And yes, Ishan Inun is back in the he's in the park now. Uh, he didn't start the game, but they have eight, brought him yeah. in. Yes, they have brought him in, the big man for uh, Kingswood. Stop. Probably feeling the pressure of uh, St. Joseph sco scoring early tries. So they have uh, opted to go with the experience of him. And yes, uh, Naveen Mara Singha. Yes, uh, St. Joseph still going forward. Navin Marsing uh, made a very good run once again. They are playing to their strengths. They are big forwards, like to see, and they are going a horn with uh, speedy number 14. 
My, that would have been... Is it the bonus point try? That's uh, Allah Hakon for uh, St. Joseph's. And that's the bonus point already for St. Joseph's. What a performance uh, from the boys from Maradana. They have uh, come out here all guns blazing and they have completely diminished any hope that Kingswood had in the first 20 minutes of the game. Well, well, well. 20 minutes gone and they have the bonus point in hand. So this is some um, exploiting the defensive network of uh, Kingswood just uh, pumping their legs. Uh, Kings, uh, the Joe's lads, the Josephians just uh, pouncing on the opportunities, not looking back uh, and going for that all-important four bonus point tries. Uh, so they have been showing intentions like right from the kickoffs. Two minutes down the uh, first uh, whistle, they got the under the post penalty, but they never opted for the kick. They went for the five pointers, the big five pointers. This is what uh, uh, Isipatana has been doing throughout the season. They have been getting all bonus points uh, in the season, but now for the first time uh, in this year's Schools Rugby League, St. Joseph's College got a bonus point with four tries. St. Joseph's, they know that uh, they need all the points they can take from any game and this is Randeep. What a kick that is, that goes through, so he adds the two extra points. As a St. Joseph's, they lead by 24 points to nil. What a kick from uh, Randeep. I beg your pardon, it's uh, Ruiz the Rodrigo. Ruiz the Rodrigo with the uh, conversion for uh, St. Joseph's. What a kick from uh, Rodrigo. Rodrigo and Randeep both look, uh, look like the same. So most of the time, uh, we uh, tend to uh, make that mistake. And uh, as Vaidhanatha, after being lifted, drops the ball on the air. So, again and again, advantage for the Kingswood lads. I think the referee uh, not happy uh, with uh, something going on. Not happy with the uh, physio of uh, Kingswood College, I think. And the assistant referee, uh, I think, suggested that uh, he should be taken out of the uh, stadium completely. They are having a little chat uh, with the uh, Kingswood official. The uh, Kingswood College uh, officials are uh, making sure that uh, it's all sorted at the moment so we can uh, get uh, back into the action of this encounter between uh, St. Joseph's and uh, Kingswood. The circular was issued by the referees urging uh, to only uh, appoint uh, schoolboys to, uh, to uh, act as water carriers and also the team physio and uh, the team coaches but uh, no one else uh, can come into the uh, pitch uh, wearing uh, sorts of uh, different attires so referees making sure things are in line and uh, it's great to be back uh, with uh, referee calls on time to start uh, and ball in advantage for Kings.
St. Joseph's uh, 24. They have already secured the bonus point. Uh, Kingswood, they have had uh, no answer whatsoever to this uh, onslaught from uh, the Joes. And here's an advantage. Ishan Ninun tries to take it quickly. As from to uh, Kingswood here, Ekanaika with the feed in. Kingswood, uh, they need to find something to hold on to here to uh, come back into this game. They still have time, but uh, unfortunately, St. Joseph's, they have scored four tries. And yes, Kingswood coming out brilliantly. That was uh, the number 13 uh, for uh, Kingswood. Imanka Ishara, the skipper. More advantage uh, to Kingswood. Late charge from the uh, St. Joseph's player, the number 10, Randika Dahamje. And I think they are going for the uh, points, Kingswood. I think the thinking is uh, here right before half time. Something is better than nothing. So three points uh, they are going in rather than uh, exploiting the harsh uh, defense of the uh, Josephian lads, uh, Laxi. As they went for the uh, three-pointer earlier as well, but unfortunately missed the uh, kick. Azmi for Kingswood, uh, he will uh, try to uh, rectify that this time. But this time they have actually uh, changed the uh, kicker. They have asked uh, Imanka Ishara to uh, try and add the three points for his team. Imanka Ishara was a part of the team last year as well, uh, one of the... Uh, Two, three players who actually shine for them during that very hard season for them. And yes, Iman Gaishara adding the much needed uh, three points uh, for his team. It's 24 points to three here at the uh, Pali Kali Rock Stadium. Finally, the lads from Dandel Hills uh, back on the scoreboard for the first time in this uh, encounter. And at Royal Complex, uh, Wesley putting on a penalty and uh, St. Anthony is putting on a penalty earlier. Scores read at 10 points to 3 in favour of the Double Blues with uh, Rodrigo starting off uh, with a nice uh, high-hanging uh, restart. As David Marasing uh, there once again, making sure that they uh, took the ball from that restart kick itself. A good high-hanging uh, restart kick from uh, Rush the Rodrigo and the skipper did the rest. They have the ball now, unfortunately. They have uh, lost the ball, Kingswood, with the advantage coming from the side, says the referee, uh, Jehan Natukorala, the culprit there. Here's uh, Azmi for Kingswood, uh, trying to gain territory with that kick. Here's the replay. Here's uh, clearly Jehan Natukorala coming from the sides. Getting some uh, good meters there. As we Kingswood, uh, they trail by 21 points. That's a huge, huge uh, gap. We are still in the 25th minute uh, of this encounter. Kingswood may be having uh, after effects of that encounter against uh, Isipatana, where it was again. A disastrous start for them uh, with uh, play continuing. And that was Ishan Inun making the collection uh, from that uh, line out. The number eight, one of the most impressive players in the squad for Kingswood. And here's uh, Navin Mar Singh again. He's out there when they attack and he's out there when they defend as well. What a player he's turning out to be in this game. Uh, Navin Mar Singh, look at that. No answer whatsoever in the Kingswood players, but uh, that's an advantage. Another kickable penalty for the Kingswood lads.
Ishan Inun uh, having some trouble. Ishan Inun um, came into the park and uh, straight away uh, made a difference. I think uh, Kings would they manage to uh, make some good uh, runs during the last five minutes or so. That's mainly because of uh, Ishan Inun, but. Uh, out, 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 out. And last week Ishan is having a, a small uh, bleed, uh, bleeding situation. I think it's a blood bin uh, for him. So, no, but he has opted to stay. The uh, referee advised him to go, but uh, he has uh, taken the decision to uh, stay out there and continue playing. So, can uh, the keeper Iman Ishar add three more points to their score? It's 24 points to three here. And it doesn't go through, unfortunately, for someone with the cape belt here, like Iman Kishara. That really should have been a kick that he got through, but unfortunately, it will stay 24 points to 3. And it's going to be a 22 meter dropout for uh, St. Joseph's. These lost points proving vital for the. Lads from Candy, the home side here. Yes, Ishan Inun makes the collection. Gives it to Azmi. Azmi goes for the kick. Makes the collection, Rodrigo. But the referee. The ball back with Kingswood and they have managed to enter the 22 meter territory. Here's the replay. It's going to be a scrum uh, very close to that uh, try line for Kingswood. They need to make sure they uh, go over with this move. Fine. Take a close look at uh, Ishan Ninun. He'll be someone that they rely on to make sure they get the five points from here. As Ekanayaka takes the ball out. Azmi tries to go for a show and go. Gives the ball out. This is brilliant from Kingswood. Advancing towards that try line. Bandara gaining some valuable meters. And here's Azmi. He makes the first uh, tackler but uh, gets tackled by the next one. Ekanayaka gives the ball to uh, Fernando. Fernando gets tackled. Kingswood still with position. He has Ishan Inun. Ishan Inun tries to go for the show and go. But three defenders out there to make sure Ishan Inun doesn't go over. Here's Azmi. Azmi gives the ball out to the skipper. Imanka Ishar, the skipper. And here's uh, Mira Sekar for Kingswood. They're still there and they're about Kingswood. Here's Azmi. Here's uh, the number six for Kingswood, De Silva. Zeke Naiga this time. Gives it out to Azmi. Azmi gives it out to Akila Dilshan. Akila Dilshan going ever so close but still few meters short. Yes, Azmi again. A loose pass there. But they make the collection. They still have the ball. The referee stops the play. They have two penalties, Kingswood. Where will they take it? That was probably the most interesting part of this game, uh, Laksisi, where Kingswood had a marauding set of uh, run breakthroughs uh, but failing to score and uh, the big number eight, Inun. Kingswood trying to get that first try on the board. Almost fumbled it but they still have the ball, Kingswood. But uh, St. Joseph's defence coming into play and they have uh, lost the ball, Kingswood, unfortunately. That uh, little phase of play looked uh, very, very impressive for Kingswood, but unfortunately, they couldn't score a try. That's the problem. St. Joseph's with the opportunity to get out of jail. Probably for the first time in this game, St. Joseph's feeling a little bit of pressure. Rodrigo with that kick uh, makes the collection. Kingswood and here's Azmi. And like you said, Laksis, that pressure has been felt by uh, Joes not putting that ball out. 
Yes, St. Joseph's uh, trying to run here. Goes for the uh, long pass and they make the knock forward. And this is going to be a chase here. Imanka Ishara and Nishan Inun chasing it. Can Imanka Ishara touch down? Yes, he does. The first try for the home team as the uh, Kingswood crowd is all elated here at the Trinity College Rugby Stadium. The must need at first try. A gallant uh, run by the skipper, proving that his leadership abilities to marshal his troops, uh, the lads from Dundon Hills, Kingswood College. An absolutely brilliant uh, piece of work Mark, Mark. by the Kingswood lads. As the skipper, the try scorer, gets ready to put the points on board uh, for his conversion. And from Royal Complex, it's an even Stevens game, 10 all. Wesley 10, St. Anthony's 10, a tied encounter just at the brink of half time. Behind the line, behind the line, behind the line. Here's the skipper trying to add the two extra points. He does. 24 points to 10 now. Half time. And that's going to be the half time. Kingswood College uh, making a little comeback in the latter parts of this uh, first half. But uh, St. Joseph's College, uh, they still have a 14 point buffer as we head into the half time. St. Joseph's, they were brilliant during the uh, first 15 to 20 minutes, Muad. But uh, Kingswood. They have uh, managed to find some life in the last uh, five minutes of the first half. Oh yes, not to disappoint their home fans here with the roaring support of the fans from Kingswood here at Pallikale. They have uh, showed uh, that they are not a team to be taken uh, lesser of or not a team who are not able, capable of uh, proving their talents and skills in the rugby field. It's 10 points to 24 in favour of the Joes but Kingswood coming back stronger to bite back the Joes who have already secured the all-important bonus point uh, here at Pallikale. As uh, Kingswood College uh, showing that uh, they are still up to the task here. The second half will be very interesting if uh, Kingswood continues to play in the same manner they played in the uh, final few minutes of the first half. And Joseph's probably... Uh, he's up a bit after the uh, bonus point, right, Muad? I think that's the uh, mistake they did. And uh, he has uh, Keel's Crest and uh, Naimiris uh, Chicken Sausages. The bite that bites back uh, just like uh, Kings would manage to bite back uh, in the uh, final stages of the first half. This is uh, an ideal, ideal pairing to spice up your parties and hangouts and gatherings with a unique and all new flavor that will sting your taste buds with a hit of spicy Naimiris. This is uh, available at uh, all Kiel supermarkets island wide and here are the uh, highlights from the uh, first half during the uh, first uh, few moments of the first half it was all about uh, St. Joseph's their skipper will be uh, present in many of those uh, highlights now in Marasinghe had a very good game and uh, their forwards had a brilliant game as well as they managed to put under a lot of pressure the defence of uh, Kingswood so uh, then the uh, little kick and chase uh, from uh, St. Joseph's. This was uh, the third try for them. Randiga Dahamjaya, the uh, fullback coming into the pass. <laughs> St. Joseph's. Lucy the Rodrigo getting his uh, first uh, conversion right. And then the uh, third, in the fourth and final try uh, for St. Joseph's. Sanuka Alahakon scoring that try. And uh, what a kick that was uh, from uh, Rushi the Rodrigo. Not the easiest of angles, but he managed to kick it through to add the uh, two extra points. And this was the final move of the first half. Uh, skipper Iman Kishara for Kingswood, making sure that they went to half time with a try on the board. And he managed to convert it as well. So, all the 10 points they got from their skipper Iman Kishara. So uh, it's 24 points to 10 in favour of uh, St. Joseph's College here at the uh, Trinity College Rugby Stadium in Palo Lecale. We will head to a very short commercial break and we will be back with the live action from the second half. Stay tuned.
beautiful outside and inside. Now we're ready to look at Dandex. Active Clean Basol Palamuse de Minma is sorry, Ivakarai. Hamadam Dandex now, Hamadam no problem. Dandex, his and the Hase Idirieta. Now we're ready to look at Dandex. Active Clean Basol Palamuse de Minma is sorry, Ivakarai. Hamadam Dandex now. Hamadam no problem. Dandex. His and the Hase Idirieta. Hamadam Dandex now. Hamadam no problem. Dandex. His and the Hase Idirieta. Advantage at the moment, 24 points to 10. Kingswood uh, scored a try just a few moments before the uh, half-time whistle. So they trail by 14 points. It was uh, 24 points to nil, but uh, Kingswood College managed to uh, make a little comeback uh, during the final five minutes of that first half. The uh, players are already out there in the middle. They are waiting uh, for the uh, match official to uh, come out. Kingswood, of course, they'll be very eager to go out there and perform because uh, finally, for the first time in this match, they have some momentum over the uh, St. Joseph's team. St. Joseph's, on the other hand, they have four, four different try scorers. They already have the uh, bonus point with them, but uh, they really can't uh, afford to uh, loosen up here because uh, Kingswood, they are very, very uh, capable of uh, making a comeback in this second half although they trail by uh, 14 points and here they are the officials uh, arriving for the uh, second half to kick off Iman Kaishara he has added all the 10 points for his team scored the try 
Uh, made sure the uh, penalty went through and then uh, converted his own try as well. Captain! Captain! Things would go on with that momentum, Lachisi, who, which they had in the last few phases of the game. They can pull out an upset here. It's just uh, two points, uh, two scores away uh, from uh, the Joes uh, catching up with the Joes of that 14 no, no, points no. buffer. Yes, and Joseph's with a very good collection uh, from that stop, uh, stop, stop, first stop. kick of the second stop, half. Stop. Here's Ishan Inun. Ishan Inun uh, trying to find some space. No! And they have lost the ball, uh, Kingswood. Not what they wanted. And here's uh, St. Joseph's. And this time it's Kingswood. Who sealed no, the ball no, from uh, the Joes. Platform, no hands, platform. Say. Almost looked like a uh, holding on. Stop. Goes for that uh, kick and change option. And that's a knock forward. <laughs> Daham Jaya making the mistake. A cardinal error inside their own 22 meter line from uh, Daham Jaya. The Josephian Lachisi feeling that pressure soon after the half time as well. Whereas Kingswood still edging close to the try line with that uh, rejuvenated uh, pump up they had soon before half time. And we can see Ishan Inon switching back to the number 17 jersey. So a bit of mind uh, confusing situations uh, done by the Kingswood uh, staff. As uh, going back to um, Ishan Inun's situation, he was uh, not originally a part of the uh, starting 15. We even talked about that uh, while showing the team cards. But uh, then he was uh, brought back in and he uh, made a difference straight away. Kingswood College uh, will rely heavily on him to make sure that they uh, make a comeback in this encounter. And uh, going back to that knock forward, uh, Damja is uh, generally very, very good when it comes to moments like that. But... Uh, made that error that occasion to give the ball uh, away to Kingswood. The uh, medical officials are uh, tending to some of the uh, St. Joseph's uh, players. There's Ekanayaka, uh, this drama for Kingswood with the feeding. Both the teams very vocal at this drum. The ball is available for Kingswood, Ekanayaka. Gives it out to Azmi. Azmi gives it out to his skipper. Very good defensive work from uh, St. Joseph's. And that's advantage uh, to St. Jo Joseph's there. Off his feet, uh, says the referee. Not what Kingswood wanted. St. Joseph's uh, defensive line up to the task and they uh, added a lot of pressure on that uh, third collector for Kingswood. Here's uh, St. Joseph's College uh, going for that uh, clearance kick to find territory. A very good kick. Great uh, piece of work from uh, Rusla Rodrigo. Mark. Must be breaking the hearts Everybody of the Kingswood fans and the players after so much of hard work. After some brilliant moves, uh, giving away silly possession like Ten. that in Early some in crucial box. moments of the game looked uh, very positive in their rugby they were showing good intentions in scoring Please clear gap the instructing the players uh, not to close the gap uh. yes Kingswood going for that mall once again take a close look at uh, Naveen Marasinghe he will be uh, he will come into act very soon here Ishan Inun thought he uh, managed to seal the ball but Collapsing the mall, says the referee. More advantage uh, to St. Joseph's. A very good uh, line out from uh, Seneviratna with that throw. Lanka making the collection. St. Joseph's. Uh, they are searching for points, more and more points. That's what they want in this uh, encounter. They scored four tries in the uh, first half and they're looking for that fifth one early in the second half. And probably go in uh, 
a step further in controlling and having the driving seat of the match and probably give some chances uh, to their fresh legs or they might be all in for a try fest here that's what they might must be looking forward especially going forward in the league uh, where try scored might come into effect uh, nonetheless with the bonus point st joseph the lads from maradana are still ahead ball. in this game and he has the rolling ball st joseph's going forward just few meters away now and that is the fifth try very very well done from uh, st joseph's the fifth try for them the rolling ball no answer from king zood to that move That's exactly what uh, St. Joseph's wanted after Kingswood uh, managed to uh, find some momentum in the latter parts of the first half. Kingswood, they have uh, come out here in the second half to uh, score a try to uh, make sure that Kingswood uh, doesn't get any sort of chance to uh, make a comeback in this encounter. And here's uh, Rodrigo trying to add uh, two more points. Can he make it 31 points to 10? No, it's not even close. Uh, Rodrigo doesn't get it right, so it will stay 29 points to 10. A 19 point buffer for the uh, visitors. Uh, I think I'll like to see uh, Joe's uh, team players uh, seem to be hearing our commentaries. Uh, we were telling that they might go in for the fifth try because they didn't go for the points uh, when they took the penalty. So they are showing superb uh, uh, form of uh, rugby here. Intentions are going for the big five numbers and not for the three pointers. Very unfortunate for Kingswood. Uh, tries to uh, try to get the ball back. Uh, no, right into his side away, but uh, that actually bounced uh, forward not rolling away says the referee so uh, more advantage uh, coming towards uh, St. Joseph's here are the Joes in the attack if that pass was made properly could have been a superb uh, free running spree for the Josephians goes for the uh, kick and chase very good collection Great from uh, Baduddin and he uh, kicks the ball into touch. Great piece of work from the uh, Kingswood fullback. Mark. Red, red, red. Ten. And down in Colombo, Wesley College and St. Anthony's, that's a very close game. Wesley leading 17 points to 13 over the Eagles. Wesley searching for their first gear win of the season after losing three very close games. Now coming back to uh, Ale Kale, that's a crooked throw. The first real uh, loose throw from uh, Senvi Ratna. He had a very good game, but uh, that was uh, not up to the mark. Yes, of course, uh, Josephians are well trained by Dulanjana Vijay Singer, who has been with the Joes uh, outfit for uh, almost three years, working with the lads from uh, Dali Road. Uh, and it looked as a very surprising, uh, superb, uh, well worked uh, call. Three in front and three at the back, uh, but nonetheless, the throw was uh, quicker, so ball again in favour of the Kingswood lads. Here's Ekanayaka, this drama for uh, Kingswood. Takes the ball out, gives it out to Azmi. Azmi gives it to his skipper Imanka Ishara who decides to kick. Kicks it to space. But uh, St. Joseph's up to the task here. Here's Lamjaya, one of the try scorers. Tries to go for a show and go. Gets tackled. And the ball has been stolen. Kingswood with the ball now. Here's Ekanayaka. Use it, say. Gives the ball out to Rasanjana. 
Asanjana, the number two for Kingswood. And this is another turnover. This time it's a Senevi Ratna. Now, in fact, it's uh, Atukorala who uh, gets the ball back for St. Joseph's. And here's uh, St. Joseph's on the attack here. Almost, almost lost the ball. And what a tackle that is. Let's see uh, what the referee says. Not sure whether that's a very safe tackle, uh, Muad. In fact, uh, it was a very hilarious uh, uh, time period in the game where the ball was swinging from one side to one side. Joe's was stealing and Kingswood was stealing and it was going either side and finally Joe's had that opening. And the uh, assistant referee uh, informs the uh, main official that it should be a yellow card to Azmi. As we mentioned, uh, not the best way to tackle Muad, the, the uh, safety of the uh, players coming to play. That's not the best of tackles from Azmi. I think also it was also not intentional, it was spur of the moment, it was excitement, he was going in for the tackle, so nonetheless uh, in that sta safety matters, so Azmi a very vital player who uh, had a very decent outing uh, throughout the encounter today, oh, going in for that try towards uh, number 14, Sanuka Alahakon. It's 29 points to 10. St. Joseph's, the visitors uh, with the lead. Didn't get uh, much distance as he would have liked uh, Rodrigo with that kick. Lux is going off the topic, uh, off the park. Uh, it's a very interesting affair here where uh, Kingswoodians are coached by the well-known uh, Nilfa Ibrahim, one of the legends produced by the Kingswood uh, College ten, ten, here ten, in ten, Candy. Ten, ten. Yes, uh, so he played for Kingswood uh, back in the early 2000s Number and later nine, went on to play brilliantly for Candy Sports Club as well. Senevi Ratna didn't get his uh, throw right in the previous line out. Let's see whether he can get it right this time. Yes, he does. Going for that uh, rolling mall again, uh, St. Joseph's getting their players in correct position. And here's uh, White Denata. Here's Randeep. They have space. Skipper Naveen Marasing. They have space out there. Rodrigo gives the ball out to Dahamja. Dahamja scores his second try of the game, and that's the sixth try for St. Joseph's. They move to 34 points. Last is his keeper Navin Marasinghe unselfishly popped the pass out. He could have gone alone, but he passed the ball and got the supporting players go in for the whitewash. Four points in the first half and two points in the second half. St. Joseph's are on a try scoring spree here. As we see Ruchita Rodrigo preparing for the kick. As Rodrigo. Two successful conversions are uh, out of uh, five and it's going to be two out of six that doesn't go through so it will stay 34 points to 10 St. Joseph's uh, with a 24 point buffer is the replay again as we see the sun is off here at Pallikale the clouds are uh, slowly, slowly covering the pitch here. Surrounded by the beautiful Digana Mountains here, the Palikale Stadium. A picturesque venue for rugby. 
as uh, Kingswood with the restart kick. Kingswood, Kingswood College uh, uh, inserting a lot of pressure on that uh, collector for St. Joseph's. And yes, St. Joseph's running from their own 22. Gives the ball out. Gives a good offload out here. Yes, uh, the number 14 for uh, St. Joseph's. Tries to uh, cut back inside. Gets tackled in the process. That was Randeep who offloaded uh, out there. No, 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 no. Creating space for Alahakon to go deep into the Kingswood half. And uh, now they are making the mistakes which uh, Kingswood, who Kingswood were doing early in the first half. Going in for the red zone and giving away possession. And uh, back in Colombo, Wesley, surprisingly, are uh, in the driving f uh, seat against St. Anthony's 22 points to 13. Found some uh, good meters there with the kick. Iman uh, Kaishara. Now that could have uh, easily been the uh, seventh try for St. Joseph's, but uh, Kingswood uh, somehow managed to uh, stop that passage of play, but uh, a brilliant piece of work from Randeepa and then a very good run from uh, Sanuka Alahakon for St. Joseph's. And that's brilliant from St. Joseph's, not very good from Kingswood. They have lost their own line out. Here's Randeepa. Randeepa gives the pass out. St. Joseph's going, going and going. They're in the 22 meter territory. Let's run deeper again. That's a high shot, I think. Yes, the referee calling for advantage. No advantage. And the line is also offside. Uh, offside. All offside. The Kingswood lads just uh, nerves on getting onto them That's and rushing offside. things too much. And um, here we see a very kickable uh, penalty to the post. But the Josephians showing their high scoring intentions and going for the touch Alex take a ball and Alex so Patim Bandi So Selvi Ratna with another throw in in the 22 meter territory of uh, Kingswood, St. Joseph's uh, searching for that uh, seventh try. All the yes. seven tries have been scored in this game uh, with uh, many stoppages, stop start affair with uh, the rolling mall of uh, St. Joseph's going steadily. Obstructions as the referee, so it's advantage uh, for uh, King Zulias Ishan Inun going straight towards that uh, pack of St. Joseph's players. Kingswood College uh, really should have tried to work their line, but uh, no advantage, uh, not 10 meters, uh, says the referee. Alex, number four. As we are marking the 50th minute mark on our clock. Skipper Ishara for the Kingswood College lads here, the home side. Clearing for touch. So a line out uh, near the halfway mark uh, for Kingswood. Rasanjana. Get back, get back, get back, get back. In fact, it's uh, Ishara with the uh, throw in this time. Yes, Kingswood, the uh, two players almost uh, collided with each other, and here's the big man, Ishan Inun, going uh, towards that hit. Advantage uh, in favor of Kingswood at the moment. Not sure where to go. Uh, that's uh, Disan Ayaka for Kingswood. Referee going back to that uh, initial advantage. Not rolling away, says the referee. Yes, Imanka Ishara. 
trying to uh, gain some meters with the kick. Kings would they enter the uh, opposition territory with that uh, kick from their skipper. And there is a replacement uh, coming in for St. Joseph's College. And also the number 10 uh, for Kingswood, Azmi. He's back in action after his uh, time at the naughty chair. The referee uh, waiting uh, for a new ball to arrive and also until uh, some uh, substitutions are being made Kingswood bringing in some uh, fresh legs out into the middle for this uh, final 20 minutes of this uh, game. Time on. Early in the Ezishar with the throw in and K uh, Joyce and Josephs they have managed to uh, win the line out of Kingswood. Stay. Here's uh, Randeep. Stop. Stop, right. Stop. Gives the ball out to uh, Dahamje who decides to kick. Fine touch. Great piece of work from uh, Dahamje. Right mark. With fresh legs in for the Josephians, so they'll be trying to pounce more on the Kingswoodians and go for those uh, big five pointers. Time on. Ten. Yes, uh, Kingswood with the throw in, and once again, St. Josephs they have managed to. Uh, Win the uh, line out of Kingswood and here St. Joseph's on the attack here. Still with position here, St. Joseph's. Searching uh, for someone to give the ball out. That was uh, Costa for uh, St. Joseph's. And here's the uh, skipper, Navin Mar Singh. Advancing forward even with uh, four Kingswood defenders uh, hanging on to him. That was uh, a knock forward from Randeep but uh, the referee going back to the early advantage not rolling away. So uh, St. Joseph's uh, they will uh, go for the kick once again not for the three points. They will try to uh, gain territory. You saw on your screen uh, Randeep pointing at the post and asking the staff uh, whether to go for the three-pointer but the message is uh, clear and loud that they are going in for the touch and going for the big points a very good kick from uh, Rodrigo there now it's up to the uh, line out they will uh, most probably go for that uh, rolling mall uh, from this line out once again skipper Navin Mara Singha in very good form today has been a menace ten, ten, out there ten, ten. for the Kings with boys. And here they are. Fortunately, that's a loose ball. But uh, St. Joseph's, they have managed to recover. And here they are advancing towards the try line again. Miss St. Joseph's are. Uh, Forwards will be in action most probably in the next few moves of the game. Here's Navin Marasinga. Still going Navin Marasinga, but uh, Kingswood managed to uh, get him down. Ishan Inu trying his uh, level best here, but St. Joseph still with the ball and more advantage. 
penalty for the Joes. And here's uh, number 17, Ishan Ninun. Not rolling away, says the referee. Ishan Ninun receives a yellow card. Wait, 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 wait. Mark here, mark here, mark here. Wait, 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 wait. And that's the seventh try for St. Joseph's. They're just uh, getting the job done quite easily against Kingswood. That's now th three tries in the uh, second half. Here you see the replay. Skipper Mara Singer, as he has been marshalling his troops uh, throughout the encounter, playing in his natural habitat, uh, the number eight position. Go to the Rodrigo putting off uh, the third uh, conversion for today. He didn't have the best of his days uh, with the boot today. Restart kick, uh, not going well for Kingswood, so it's going to be a scrum, the halfway mark for St. Joseph's. They still have time to even uh, get more tries, St. Joseph's, they'll really love to get at least a try or two in the remaining 13 minutes. On the other hand for Kingswood, they must make sure that uh, they uh, try to uh, cut off this uh, deficit before the uh, end of play. Yes, yes. Second in, second in. Second in, hurry up. Coach! Bang! There's Randeepa with the uh, feed into the scrum for Joes. Steady, both steady. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. That's Randeep offloads uh, right into traffic uh, to Ruchit Rodrigo. Rodrigo barge in and trying to build up. It's uh, the ball in favour of Kingswood as they have been defending fiercely. But uh, St. Joseph's of course uh, after heavy defence from Kingswood scoring six plus seven tries here. Securing that early bonus point in the first half as well. We have, uh, we have uh, less than 12 minutes remaining according to our clock. St. Joseph's 41, Kingswood 10. Coach! It's fair to say here, uh, St. Joseph's, they have already uh, sealed this game. Set. Steady, both steady. Is the uh, number 21 uh, for uh, Kingswood. Disa Nayaka. Disa Nayaka tries to take it quickly, but uh, referee Raghi asks Raghi him Raghi. to come back and to uh, take it from the uh, mark. Number three. three. And going back to uh, Colombo Muad, St. Anthony's, they have taken the lead out of nowhere from Wesley. They're leading uh, 28 no, points no, no, to 22. No, 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 no. Yes, the Sana Aika. Here's the ball to Azmi. No! Kingswood. That's a good piece of work there. Here's a Kingswood on the attack here. Gives the pass out. Here's the number six for Kingswood, De Silva. That was a great run from uh, Sikuraz no, 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 no. for Kingswood. He gave no. the ball out to De Silva. He tried to find the gap, but uh, the St. Joseph's defenders were already out there. And here's uh, De Silva again with a very good offload to his number five, Silva. It's Disa Nayaka complaining to the referee that uh, St. Joseph's 
the tacklers are not trolling the way and uh, here's a yellow card coming to St. Joseph's showing his frustration towards the referee you can't do that uh, the number 20 five for uh, St. Joseph's that's uh, white Yes, uh, this is Anayaka with the feed in. Can Kingswood uh, cross over for a second try? This is Anayaka. Takes the ball out from this drum. Yes, Kingswood on the charge here. That was uh, Bandara trying to find space. Here's Azmi. Gives a little off load to his uh, number three, Hev again. Here's uh, Disa Nayaka again. Rush defense coming in from the Josephians and again uh, coming in from the sides. Uh, Kingswood giving away possession, easy possession to St. Joseph's. Uh, Kingswood finally getting some work done in their hands but uh, losing all important possession right in front of the St. Joseph's red zone and now Richard Rodrigo will try to put Joe's clear and ahead and find good touch to go and form their ever famous uh, strong forwards a rolling mall or the fast win three quarters will run the ball from end to end Red mark. Is the uh, line out for uh, St. Joseph's and I think it's Randeep who's uh, delivering the ball to the line out. The scrum half acting as the hooker there. And here's Randeep back in the line once again. Gives a long pass. Uh, and here's uh, St. Joseph's on the attack again. This is uh, Dahamjay. Dahamjay almost evaded two defenders. Gives a good offload out to Ruchita Rodrigo. Another big tackle, almost, almost. He was lucky he was to the player landed uh, safely on the floor. Yes, yeah, St. Joseph's with a lot of numbers outside. And that's the uh, big man, Navin Mara Singer, just uh, fended off the first defender and just outran the next one to score his hat trick. What a game, what a performance from the St. Joseph skipper to score a hat trick against Kingswood here in Pallekale. Arguably the biggest player on the pitch today. Navin Mara Singer, look at that. A friend of a big tanker bulldozing run by the Dali Road skipper. Proving again and again that he is one of the biggest, strongest boys here in the Dialogue Schools Rugby League 2023. With Rochet Rodrigo scoring that uh, easy conversion under the post, St. Joseph's College are now clear in the driving seat. Uh, St. Joseph's are uh, looking well and truly. Uh, with a chance to uh, score 50 points in this game, a half century. Time off. Now they have scored uh, eight tries now, uh, St. Joseph's. Time on. And who's the Rodrigo? He has converted uh, four out of those eight. So a 50% uh, kicking ratio for the uh, St. Joseph's place kicker. If last is if uh, St. Joseph's uh, go in for that 50 plus mark, it will be the first time in this year's season that a school has surpassed the half century mark. 
and of course uh, eight tries in one match uh, is you, currently the highest in an encounter so impressive uh, by the Lali Road boys proving that they are now coming back stronger and ever stronger than their previous matches yes, uh, St. Joseph's. we had a lot of uh, 40s but uh, we had no 50s as Muad mentioned And yes, this run, this are now like to uh, feed in. Set. Steady, both steady. 18, 18, 18. In, in. As the uh, strum, this are now like gives the ball out. Yes, Kingswood on the move once again. No, no. He really should have passed the ball. He had two supporters. Tackler not releasing, says the referee. Takes a quick tap, ask me. Nazmi gives the ball out to Ishan Ninun. Yes, Ishan Ninun trying to replicate what his opposite number did. But uh, gets a tackle just a few meters before the try line. They lost the ball. And here's uh, Kingswood. Is that the try? The referee probably will want to have a chat with his uh, assistant referee. And yes, the try is given. Ishan Ninun made sure that... Uh, he laid the foundation to that try and then uh, Damindu Di Silva went over to score the try uh, for his team, the number five. The skipper. Imanka Ishara preparing for the conversion. Yes, Imanka Ishara trying to add the uh, two extra points to make it 17 for them. That almost, almost uh, went through, but it will stay 15 points to 48. It's just been an exciting uh, evening, Muad. We have, we have seen 10 tries in this encounter already, and uh, we certainly have time uh, to see some more. Absolutely. So, Joe's uh, seem to be not uh, contained. Uh, uh, content by what they have been doing they are going more and more for that big five pointer they got easy three pointers right in front of the uh, post but they never went for those uh, points they are always uh, they have proved that they are going for the five pointers as we see Kingswood College the replacement uh, number 20 Piat is uh, fluffing that ball right in front of him and uh, here's uh, St. Joseph's uh, going for the scrum. And another record that they can break in this game. Uh, we have only seen uh, hat-tricks from players. And Navin Mara Singh has a very good chance to score four tries in this game with the scrum coming up. So let's see. This is uh, definitely in his range. If he gets the ball, it will be very hard to stop him with the form he is in today. Here's uh, the scrum. The replacement scrum of uh, Leon Costa in pitch, uh, into the pitch, replacing uh, the experience Vihanga Randipa. And exactly as we thought, Naveen Marasinga was the one to take the ball, but unfortunately lost it backwards. Here's uh, Costa. And here's Naveen Marasinga takes the ball out from the uh, tackle there. And here's uh, Rodrigo. Very nearly went all the way, but gets tackled. No, Gives no, the no, offload no. out to promote Pereira. <laughs> and that's a knock forward, unfortunately. Navin Mara Singh looked very good to score a fourth try. And uh, unfortunately for St. Joseph's, they won't score a half century. But they will walk out in this game with the win. 48 points to 15. What a magnificent performance led by their skipper, Navin Marasinga, who scored a hat-trick. They have absolutely managed to destroy Kingswood here at Pallikale. Almost going in for that quadruple four-try 
uh, Banger, the skipper of uh, St. Joseph's College, just falling short as you can see. Uh, the Josephians are down in their kneels after the encounter. So this has what turned out to be a tri-fest here at Palikale. Mostly a one-sided affair, especially for the Josephians. Kingswood College falling short by 38 points here. What started off as a try in the first two minutes of the game, St. Joseph's never looked back after that, going in on a rampage of eight tries. The Josephians, the Hornets from Dali Road, proving their existence in this year's league with the big man, the big burly number eight, Marasinga leading from the front. As the uh, full-time uh, confirmation, St. Joseph's 48, Kingswood 15. A great performance uh, from the lads from Maldan to get this uh, second win on the board for them. Their first win was uh, not that convincing against Wesley, but here they have uh, come out all guns blazing and absolutely annihilated the uh, Kingswood boys, the home team. They'll be really disappointed, Kingswood. Uh, they promise a lot more in this season, to be honest, uh, Moa. They, they performed well in the seventh tournament. So uh, they promised a lot, but unfortunately, they have uh, not been up to the mark. They have uh, lost uh, three games in a row now. Pretty disappointing end for the Kingswood lads and the Naimiris skills, Crest Naimiris, chicken sausages, the bite that bites back like uh, the Kingswood lads who has been uh, bitten back by uh, the Josephians right from the kickoff. Kills nine, first time with sausages, a great uh, party starter. We beg your pardon for the technical error. The man of the match for today is uh, none other than Navin Mara Singer, St. Joseph's College skipper. Yes, Navin Mara Singer, he was absolutely phenomenal, uh, scored a hat-trick of tries very nearly, went over for a fourth try as well, but uh, the big number eight, uh, when it came to defence, when it came to attacking, he was always out there, he led the team from the front and uh, produced this result, so uh, St. Joseph's, they have some very important games coming up, and here are the key stats from the game, Kingswood. Two tries, St. Joseph's eight, Kingswood one successful conversion, St. Joseph's with four and uh, one penalty for uh, Kingswood uh, when it comes to the uh, key stats. So, and uh, confirmation, uh, NDB Bank player of the game, Naveen Marasinghe, the skipper for uh, St. Joseph's. So, uh, St. Joseph's, they are right back in this tournament. They have won two, they have lost two. And uh, they will uh, certainly want to end this tournament on a high as they still have chance to qualify for the next round. So here are the uh, highlights from the uh, second half. St. Joseph's uh, used uh, that uh, rolling mall very effectively throughout the game with the presence of their skipper. Navin Mara Singh, look at that. He just uh, completely made it, uh, fended off those uh, Kingswood defenders and Daham Jaya. I need to remind him about as well, he went over for two tries, he was always out there supporting his other numbers. This was uh, Naveen Mara Singh, just overpowering 4-5 Kingswood defenders uh, to go underneath the post for that try. Rodrigo converting that. And uh, Naveen Mara Singh again, right in the action. He just uh, completely... Uh, Boozled uh, that uh, line of defense from uh, Kingswood. It was uh, certainly a menace, a very, very big headache for the uh, Kingswood lads uh, throughout the day. And then uh, this try was produced uh, thanks to Ishan Inun's brilliance. Took the quick tap, got them close, and then Damidu Di Silva went over for that uh, consolation uh, second try for uh, the home team. So, uh, 
Thank you very much uh, for joining with us uh, from all around the globe because it was a very entertaining week. But next week, remember, we have some more interesting matchups coming up. DSN and I are taking on Kingswood at Havelock. St. Thomas is taking on St. Joseph's, an important game in this group at Mount Lavenia. And then Isipatana taking on St. Anthony's at London Place. Trinity taking on Science. Royal taking on Damaraja. And Sahira taking on St. Peter's and other huge flash in the other group of uh, this uh, top segment in the Dialogue Schools Rugby League 2023. So uh, thank you very much for uh, joining with us uh, throughout this week. We brought you uh, six very important games from the Dialogue Schools Rugby League 2023. You can uh, catch uh, all the uh, live action on www.thepapri.com and across all of our social media platforms and also for match articles, for uh, match albums, make sure to visit www.thepapri.com. Hoping to see all of you next week. Have a very good night. Job make a Adama Karen no one. Adama? No problem. Oh, go look the knee went to get a dress code like a black. Black? No problem. Now we're ready to look at the index. Active climber soul palamuse de men ma is sorry, Ivat Karai. So we can say and he's a portion a Karai. Not a mother. No problem. Hammer down with Dandex now. Hammer down no problem. Dandex, he's a Nida Hase Idiriata.
aloe and mint for freshness, chamomile for sensitive skin, lemon and lime for an energetic day. Big shaving foam, a change you must experience. Enjoy the infinite possibilities of the freedom of space inspired by the beauty of our land. Sri Lanka's finest finished, largest sized porcelain tile collection. Majestica. Langa tiles. Fine living. Redefined. <laughs> Rasa bedan manji rasa balakai dan alut bela. Wang kita tala nak tebena, wang ini mabin guna. Seradavi atau nari kau demi pangdama, kau demi pangdama. Prima kau demi pangdama. The digital youth account. NDBZ. NDBZ from NDB Bank. The future is banking on us. Nevum Bavarakadena. Kumarika Hamit. Sangviti Samakata. Cam oil. Big shaving form. Atviti Haki Venasakata. Coloma, beautiful outside and inside. Aloe vera and mint for freshness, chamomile for sensitive skin, lemon and lime for an energetic day. Big shaving foam, a change you must experience. Enjoy the infinite possibilities of the freedom of space, inspired by the beauty of our land. Sri Lanka's finest finished, largest sized porcelain tile collection. Majestica, Langa tiles, fine living, redefined. Nava Vedi Gunu Kala Dandex Active Climbersol Pala Musee Dhe Menma Issori Iwad Karai Hema Dhamu Dandex Nam Hema Dhamu No Problem Dandex Hisa Nida Hase Idhi Riyata Oda Mande Akkaranna Vidi Aakti Ano Eta Vai Thawan Giri Diya Jeevitaya Aakti Nilna Aakma Vishwase Nagi Sitilna Gold Opa Opa Ma Venna Beautiful outside and inside. Aloe vera and mint for freshness, chamomile for sensitive skin, lemon and lime for an energetic day. Big shaving foam, a change you must experience. Oda mande akkaranna, vidi aakti ano. Eta mai, thaman giri dia, jeevite aakti nilna, aakma vishwase nagi sitilna, gold opa opa ma venna. I came from the mud 
There's dirt on my hands Strong like a tree There's roots where I stand Oh, I've been running from the law Hope they won't shoot me down soon Catch me howling at the moon